There you go. These curved ceilings are freaking killing me. Ugh. Hey friends, we're the Browns. Chad, Katie, Addison, and Kenya, Milo, and Charlie. We live to love an adventure. This is our story of leaving the norm behind to travel the United States full time, spreading love and encouraging others to do the same. Our family motto is love always, adventure often. So hit subscribe and join us for this incredible journey. Hey everybody, what's going on? So hey, we're insulating the bus with this rigid poly board and um, I figured out a cool way to cut it that saves a ton of time rather than measuring and putting on something straight and cutting along something straight. I actually learned this when I was hanging drywall. Hung drywall, I grew up hanging drywall actually. My dad is a drywall hanger. So it's the same way we cut drywall, but I'll show you how to do it. Um, so come on in close. So I get a longer knife, so I'm just using my regular pocket knife. I catch the knife on the end of the measuring tape and then I come over to the board and I pull it the length that I want it. So right now I'm, I'm cutting pieces that are 26 inches and 5 eighths. So I find 26 inches and 5 eighths right here on the end of the board and I use my finger as a guide, basically right on the side of the, of the foam. So then the knife over here is cutting into the board and I just go down and use my finger as a guide. Cool. Then you only have it scored on one side, meaning the cut's only about halfway through because you only put your knife halfway through. You're not trying to cut the whole thing. So what you can do now, pull it away, put your hand where the score is and you just break it. Then you can come on the back side and just cut the back film. There you go. All right, so we're starting to put our ceiling in. Look, got this MDF primered. It's already primered shiplap. That's pretty awesome. Um, so. Originally we bought the the wood MDF or the wood shiplap and it was way too crooked. It couldn't even work with it. I got a couple pieces up and we took it all back and got this stuff. So it's looking good. curved ceilings are freaking killing me. I mean, I'm having a horrible time getting them nice and tight. You can see all the gaps in the cuts. It's driving me freaking crazy. Look at that, big gaps. I don't know what to do. We've made a, we've made a pattern. I've been just like, you can see, I've been measuring like every inch and then the height from that inch and then cutting it that way. I mean, nothing I do will get it perfect. We're gonna have to find some sort of material that we can just put in the crack in the, in the corner, like a corner bead or a quarter round or something like that. But man, it is taking forever and it's kicking my butt. So right now I'm trying to do that big arch right now just out of this piece and it's, freaking crazy. I'm interested to know what other people are doing with this curve on the ceiling because it's killing me. The other thing is it's a weekend, it's a long weekend for us, Easter weekend, and I didn't order the tint. And here's the problem is like some of our walls cover up half our windows. And so I've got to get the tint and tint the windows before I get this wood on the rest of the walls. And that means we're gonna be at a standstill until I can find the tent that's gonna work and get it shipped to us and, ugh, this is frustrating. I'm getting very, very worried about being done on time and within budget and it's freaking me out a little bit. I'm, I'm in a really frustrated place right now. I hope it gets, I hope I get feeling a little bit better. We're gonna, we're supposed to take, next couple days we're supposed to take a trip and go do some fun Easter stuff. We're gonna stay at a resort up close here and do a train ride and do egg hunt and stuff, but I really wanted to get into a good space here before we went and did that so that I wasn't feeling crazy and distracted. But anyway, hope it comes together. All right, my friends, we're pushing pause on the bus for a couple days 
going on a little Easter vacay up into the mountains into a resort. Just wanted to show you we have some ceiling in the main cabin area. This is our little main uh, living room area right next to the driver's seat. So it's so cool to see it coming together. I think it looks awesome. Um, I can't wait to have a full ceiling and uh, well, I can't wait to have a finished bus, but uh, it's looking good. I'm a little bit more hopeful right now than I was before. Um, and just feeling like we can we can get this done. Anyway, off we go on our vacation. Love always, adventure often. Bye. Wow, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoy seeing our videos as much as we love making them. Don't miss a single adventure or bus moment. Make sure you hit subscribe and share with everyone you know. We'll see you next week and remember to love always and adventure often.